Hello everyone, welcome back to another animatronic skinning video. Now some of you guys will know that I've really wanted this animatronic for quite a while. I was planning on purchasing one to make into Candy Mare from the My Little Pony story, Something Sweet to Buy It. And I actually still have a deposit on that pony. The one that I'm planning on purchasing is a For Real Friends S'mores. But this one is called Butterscotch, they're basically the same animatronic, just in different colours. S'mores is a darker brown with white. I'm definitely still going to be buying the S'mores animatronic and making it into a different character. I am open for suggestions, but the probability of it being My Little Amnesia Fluttershy is quite high. And as originally planned, I will be purchasing that once we're not in lockdown anymore. So I was never supposed to have this butterscotch pony. There were never meant to be two giant pony animatronics in my possession. But I was going for a walk the other day and I just happened to find her in hard rubbish, which is so like unbelievably awesome. I was kind of bored this lockdown because I didn't have the pony to make into Candy Mare. And alternatively to that, I couldn't get the dog animatronic that I'm going to make into Fetch from Five Nights at Freddy's. So it was so awesome to just stumble across this on the side of the road. And if you're wondering if it works, that is a great question because I do not know and I cannot find out until we get the other s'mores animatronic. Now this butterscotch pony was broken in a few different ways, but probably the most notable thing is that the battery box is just completely missing. Also, if you look here, you can see that the underside of the fur is gray in some spots. I couldn't tell whether this was mold or just discoloration, but I think that this animatronic was in storage for quite a while. There may be some water damage, I'm not sure, but it was very, very, very dirty once I started skinning it, which is completely fair enough. This is a pretty old animatronic and I don't know this particular one's history. So with a bit of TLC, hopefully we can give this butterscotch pony a new life. So I did give it a good and proper clean. I know it sounds like I'm making up excuses just to rip apart this animatronic, but judging from the inside of the fur, it's probably not super safe that it still had all of the skin on it anyway. Also, I don't need an excuse to skin an animatronic. I'll just do it anyway. But back to the battery compartment. Because I don't have that piece, I can't actually test that the animatronic works. I very briefly spoke to the family who owned this animatronic. They said that it was totally okay for me to take. They put it out on hard rubbish so that someone would take it. They were moving house and they did say that it worked. So the plan is that once we get the matching s'mores animatronic, they can basically have one battery compartment between them so they can kind of share. Honestly, we will be extremely lucky if this free side of the road pony ends up working, but we'll just have to wait till after lockdown to find out. Now, if I can't get this pony working at all, we are still buying the s'mores pony. So then we'll be back at the original plan and we'll make that one into Candy Mare. And I don't know what's gonna happen with this one if it doesn't work. On top of the missing battery compartment, the tail had also broken off though I do have the tail piece. Both ears were missing and I'm not sure whether they work and the mouthpiece has snapped off and there is a piece that came off there entirely. So there is a lot that could go wrong and I'm not totally confident in my abilities to get it working if it just won't work. But if we are very, very lucky, we're gonna end up with two really awesome animatronics to reskin. And I am so excited to get started on making Candy Mare. So fingers crossed that it works. Updates are coming soon and I hope that you guys are as excited about this as I am. See you next time and thanks for watching.